Families, friends, and veterans of all ages gathered at the Guam Veterans Cemetery this Memorial Day. They joined together to commemorate and honor those who paid the ultimate sacrifice in the line of duty. People from all walks of life gathered to honor the fallen, from bikers to congressmen, active duty military to decorated veterans, and children of all ages. Among the crowd were many distinguished visitors, including the Honorable Edward B. Calvo, Governor of Guam. For everyone here, and everyone who is commemorating Memorial Day, there is a deep significance of this event. And there is solemnity in this event. Also in attendance were several veteran and motorcycle groups. They came bearing our nation's flag to remember those that were lost and what they stood for. One of the main reasons why we celebrate today is, again, to, um, to honor those people that keep us free. We don't have to live the way we do, you know? I mean, a lot of countries in the Middle East, you still, they've been going to war for 300 years. We don't have to live that way. Distinguished visitors, as well as those representing the groups in attendance, laid wreaths on graves representing all of the armed conflicts in which American lives were lost. From the First World War to Afghanistan, dozens of wreaths commemorated the sacrifice. 36th Wing Commander Brigadier General Andrew Toth explains just how important the ceremony is. We also pay tribute to the families of the fallen. We mourn their grief and share in the heavy burden that they bear. For these families, every day is Memorial Day. Reporting from Anderson Air Force Base, Guam, I'm Airman First Class Nathan Eckert.